Yo, it is Flexity, and welcome to a game called You Left Me. Played You Left Me, it's a very deep game, I know that for a fact. It's, an old, it's, like, it's kind of an old game, I don't know, like two, two, three years. But the art style is amazing. I saw a little bit of this, and uh, well, I, was, you know, I, was, I was amazed. So sit back, relax. I don't know how long this game is, but it's really deep. So if you're like, you know, sensitive to, you know, suicidal topics and everything, please like click, click off. This is going to definitely be like a, like a really deep uh, video, but without further ado, let's do it. Let's get it. 324, 2020. Oh shit. Wait, it's today. Yo, it's today. Holy shit. It's today. Not, not the, not the time, like the time. Well, the dates, the date is the same, but the time is, um, you know, we passed that. Holy shit! Yo, it was a sign. It was a sign. It was a sign to play this game. It was a sign to play this game. Holy shit! It's today. Okay, I wake up. Ooh, you're not gonna do that to me. Hold up, turn the music down a little bit so you guys, so you guys, you guys can actually hear me. All right, I wake up in the same bed, but a different world. Where am I? Why am I here? Yeah, I know that feeling. I'm waking up, feeling like you're. Not even existing, bro. I feel that. I feel that. I feel that. Not gonna lie. Uh, is there anything I can clue on? It's beat though. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's see. Roman numerals on the moon clicks at 12 hour. Clicks at 12 hour time. What happens when night falls and time runs up? How do I get out of here before then? Whoa. Who's who's the crusty ass big ass hand is that? Is that God? Look aside. Read the notes. What does that say? How does the pancake wobble? Are you a are you a pancake or a waffle fan? I'm, I'm more of a pancake person, but I know there's waffle people out there saying fuck pancakes. Well, fuck you too, now, junkie. <laughs> White magnet reads hopes. Whoa, what? Huh? Oh yeah, she probably nah. She, her vision is she just woke up, so her vision is not that you know crisp. They read. They read. How the? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. How the pancakes? Yeah. There you go, she get her vision. She almost there. I'm trying, but I can't read them. I see words, mind, but I don't understand what they mean. A mess? Try again, keep going. You got this. It, I don't know what's going on. I feel like my mind is working against me. I can't focus. I can't stop thinking about horrible things. You gotta focus. Think about the positive stuff, come on. You got, you know, take your awareness to the positive. Don't let it go to the negative. I know you've been dealing with a lot of shit. But, you know, you got this. We ruin for you. I'm not scared of failure. I'm not, yeah, I'm not scared of failure. Try again. After a few attempts, I get it. Exactly. Once you, like, once you, once you struggling, don't see it as a failure. Keep going until you succeed. You'll get it. Exactly. Yeah, how does the pancake wobble? The Baghdad. It's <laughs> good. First thing you don't read, silly reminder, uh, hello, from you know who, not the Harry Potter kind. I was kind of trash. Oh, the uh -huh. The second note read, reads, remember, Swain's Lane. Why? Oh, she forgot. Damn. The third note reads, give this girl some milk. <laughs> Get, she needs some milk. Alright, that's enough for our, yeah, fridging for today. Can we talk to the cat? Well, I thought you had two eyes for a second. You only have one eye? What type of cat is that? You gave me this cat. I love him. Like you had. Around him, I feel comfortable. No need to pretend. Hmm. Something doesn't seem right. But I can't remember how he looks up close. I haven't spent time with him. Not since. I'll leave you to sleep, Pat. Yeah. It's a bork, 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 bork. <laughs> what was that? I'll leave you to sleep. Yep, proof. What? You make me happy. In my heart. Yeah. <laughs> you too. Aww. Moo, 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 hee ha. You're leaving already? Okay, love. Please come back soon for purrs and snugs. You won't leave me alone. We'll see. I love you too. Aww. So, what I'm getting from the gist is that she got, she got, she has a person that gave her this cat. And I guess the person died, but I'm not sure. Is that is that a phone? Oh, she's looking at the phone to to buy the time. Yeah, I feel I feel I feel that. I feel that. Get out of bed. Yeah, let's get out of bed. Let's get some air. Let's get some fresh air. Wow, these gra these freaking art styles are so amazing. Where do I go? I need to escape this world before time runs out. You know what? I say fuck work. Since you're dealing with something, I say go to the clinic. Yo, get yourself. Oh, she has a mask. 
Everybody has masks to hide their true emotions. You see? And this is what the this is what the hospital is condoning. Were they actually giving people masks? Why is this? This is symbolizing that they they don't really help at all. Like they just say cover up, cover up your wounds, but don't really tend to them. You know, that's kind of messed. Oh, look at the shadows too. Wow. But yeah, I feel I feel that. I feel I feel that we're we're in a mask. I feel I feel that intensely. But sometimes sometimes when you have somebody there, like open up, open up to them, bro. Like if you have somebody, open up to them. Don't, it's like think think of the positives, you know. But I know I know it's hard to think of the positive when everything around you is always the press of the negative. I know. Like I've been I've been through that shit a lot. I still go through that shit. But you know, I would say like keep living. Like do you basically. If it's if it's people messing with you, do you fuck them? If it's if it's if it, even your family members, fuck them. Do you like this is your life? Live it, live it to the best of your abilities. You know, wait a line, give up and go home. No, wait a line. I wait for a very long time. You need get some type of assistance. You know, just as I was beginning to lose hope, they called my name. Secrets. Sorry about the wait. Our latest experiment and happiness didn't go quite as well as planned so I had to do some crisis intervention enough about me what can I do for you today how do I get out of this world my mask is cracking I think I've lost my mind don't say your mask is cracking I feel like they're gonna give you a new mask um, how do I get out of this world they probably sent you to a mental hospital maybe that's something that's something that uh, if you say to a therapist they'll probably send you to a mental hospital I think I'm losing my mind hmm Perhaps you're experiencing head drama. No, <laughs> I can do a brain scan for you if you like. I like that. Let's see, I like that. Do it. All right, hold on. She is. That, are they really fucking up? All right, hello, ma'am. Results came back. Your brain looks perfectly healthy, but my memory isn't working. Hmm. Uh, I might have a little solution for you. We just visited them at the labs. We call them happy pills. What is it? What is it? That game that you take a pill, you happy? Well, is this like also subliminally saying that you know you need to take pills in order to be happy? A pill a day will keep the hurt away. No, like I don't know, I don't know. What do, do y'all think about um, about pills in the comments below? For me, like for me, I have an opinion. Like if you really like, if you really like have a disorder or something, like take the pills. Like I, I don't know, like take the pills because I feel like if you have like a serious mental problem, and taking those pills is like helping you to cope and stay like you know stabilized. You know, take the pills, but if you feel like you can handle it without them, they don't take them. If you feel like you can handle it without them, if you feel like you can, um, like you could beat the world without it, you know, don't take them. Because I feel like the more you take them, the more, say, a pill a day, right? So they want, they want you to make, they want you to be addicted, you know? They want you to be addicted so that way they, they can have money in their pockets, basically. So the doctor corporation would, you know, have money in their pockets. That's what I felt. That's what I feel. But if you feel if you feel like you need them, then take them. That's what I yeah. That's what I feel. That's my opinion on it. But like for her, if it, it's I don't know. I have my doubts. I don't know. That's exactly what I need. Thanks. Like I feel like she's gonna get addicted. I feel like she's gonna overtake the pills. You know. Because sooner sooner or later you're gonna keep taking the pills, right? And then your body's gonna get used to it. And then once it gets used to it, it's gonna be numb. And after that, it's like you think it's not gonna work, and you go to overdose. That's what that's what I think. That's what tends to happen. Uh, I don't know. I don't trust that shit. To be honest, I don't know. All right, they'll be here. Yours for the taking. Anytime you feel a little unhappy, I don't know. How do I get this world? The mask is cracking. That's actually for mask is cracking. It looks fine to me. Wow. How would a doctor say that it looks fine? To you you fired. I can try something else instead. You gonna tell me the pills? Bro, I feel like you're gonna overdose though. No, yeah, fine, never mind. How do I get out of this world? Excuse me? Can you repeat that? How do I get out of this world? Sorry, I'm not a tra I'm not trying to help you with that. Science of wow possible insanity. Don't mind me, I'm just taking note of a good day. That's crazy. I don't know I don't know about that either. Like would you like to hear a doctor saying uh psych like psych like you're psychotic or insane? Like that's not really helping, that's just saying like yo something is wrong with me like i don't know like this this is a big topic i i, I would like to discuss about it with y'all in the, the you know the comments below i don't know the word about giving up and go home i don't want you to give up you're the clinic is useless 
They can't fix my plan with pills and injections. Even um, even if they could, I'm too scared to let them dead, to let them in, to let anyone try. No, don't kill yourself. I'm too scared to, uh, of trusting than being left bereft again. I mean, shit. I'm sorry what you're going through. Like, I feel this. And I did attempt it many times, you know? So I relate to this shit. But it's, it's definitely not the answer. Temporary, temporary pain. You can't do a permanent solution with that. It will, it will pass. It will feel like it, it could be, it could last long for days, weeks, years, but it will pass. You don't need to, you don't need to end it now. Swine's lane, high gates. Swine's lane. I remember now. You died a while ago, and I've been denying it since. But you wouldn't want that, would you? Me stuck in my head, living living a fantasy. When there is so much more of reality to explore, the cat you left me, the flower fields that pass the metro. Now oh, this is grave. This is the person that she loves. Maybe a sibling. I don't know. Maybe a lover. He gave. I guess it's probably a lover he gave him the cat, but maybe a sibling. Oh no, I'm not sure. I love you, you know, the lover. Yeah, you left me behind. I don't blame you for leaving. Oh, he, did he kill himself? Oh no. Usually, I don't know. I don't think he. I don't think he killed himself. Because usually uh, people die, like you know, get killed, and they say the same thing. Every day I wake up thinking about trying you. Give in, survive, 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 don't give in, but I'll keep living with the memories you gifted me, without you. This is definitely a deep video. PTSD and remembering somebody that passed away. Someone that's been like really, really close to you to the point where it like gives you the motivation to live. And when they're gone, it's like, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's like your, your, your soul got cut in half. Cher cherish, cherish the people. Cherish the people. Like if you have memories of them, if you have memories of them, if you like, you, like their their energy is everywhere. Like you feel you feel that shit. Their energy is never gone. Like their physical body is gone, but their energy is never gone. And with the memories connected to the energy, it's like they never they never left. You know, cherish that. Take it all in. They don't want they don't want you to feel this way. Definitely not. They don't want you to feel this way. They don't want you to go through this. They want you to stand up strong and live the the best life that you can possibly can. So they're watching you. So give them a give them a good view, you know. Give give them a good show. Don't don't end it abruptly, you know. And I know it hurts, like for me. I shit. I could go on about my problems, but that's it's, it's personal. Uh, and dedicated to everyone who's lost anyone. Yep. I appreciate you for this game. And I'm just I'm gonna leave it like that, bro. I will leave it at a good ending because I'm not. I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to leave it at a bad ending, you know. But it sucks, man. I know it does, but I'm. I'm here for y'all, truly. I'm here for y'all. Y'all. Y'all freaking amazing to me. I'm not trying to cry, yeah, you know. I'm not trying to cry and feel down and shit, but yeah. So keep living. We we got each other. We in this together, you know. You're not alone. I appreciate the fuck out of all of you. Continue to live, even when you feel this way. You know, continue to live. Continue to make something. I love your life. I know it's hard, but don't lose the battle. You got this. Everybody's rooting for you. you including if nobody is, then I'm rooting for you. Just know that. Suicide is never the answer, bro. Never is. You have a legacy. 
Even though, even if you don't see, it, you, gotta, you gotta like it. Spexy. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'm out. This.